first ensure that I'm filming with my new hairstyle. Hey, it's Leanne, and in today's video, I will be reorganizing slash decluttering slash revamping my entire closet. So over the past couple of months, I have done quite a lot of shopping and I noticed that my closet is getting a little bit too full for my liking and I also fell in love with minimalism. So for those of you who don't know what it is, I am also not quite sure how to define it. <laughs> and I am well aware that there is a lot more to minimalism than just getting rid of a bunch of stuff and only having 10 pieces of clothing in your closet. But that is where I will be starting. I actually tried doing this yesterday but I quickly realized that I am very indecisive and way too attached to my clothes. So today we will be taking a different approach and I will be doing it in a different method. Let's get into it. Step number one thinning out the closet. In this step, I will be emptying my closet, but before I do that, I will be going through all of my hangers and every single shelf and getting rid of all of the obvious pieces of clothing that I know I'm not gonna wear and I'm gonna get rid of. But there are two rules that I have to stick to. Rule number one, if I haven't worn this piece of clothing in the past year, it has got to go. Rule number two, if there is anything wrong with this clothing, for example, it is torn or the color has faded, there's button missing, anything like that, it also, has got to go. I cleared out my entire closet. As you can see, decluttering it was way overdue. I definitely broke the rules when it came to a few clothing pieces. <sighs> oh, why am I so attached to clothing that I never even wear? <clears throat> but it is now time for the second step. I will be putting those clothes in black bags and cleaning the closet physically taking a class, getting rid of all of the dust. And finally, I took all of my storage pieces and made sure it was clean and I placed it in the cupboard where I know I want it to be, which that will change probably later, but yeah, okay. Now it is time for step three, which I could have avoided this, <laughs> but it is to categorize my clothing. So if I didn't just throw all of my clothes out of my closet and made a big pile, my clothes would have already been categorized. But since I didn't think of that, I need to recategorize everything so that I know where everything is. Okay, I know it looks like I just took everything off of my bed and threw it on the floor, but we actually have piles in here. So step four is filling the closet, but it is much easier said than done, so I actually have a plan. So the first pieces of clothing that will be going back into my closet are things that I literally cannot get rid of. So for me, this is school uniforms. The second thing I will be doing is I will be going through each pile and choosing one item. Verdict, I cannot make a decision. We are back to my indecisiveness. Both of them look my boobs look make my boob look, boobs look big. I can't get rid of these two. I literally can't. I can't. And mind you, the clothes that I'm throwing out, like oh, I wanna wear it. I wanna I wanna start wearing it. One or the other. I can't. So I only wear this with that one pants, but it looks so cute with that one pants. I'm sorry mom. Okay, hopefully like I don't think she watches my YouTube videos. A true minimalist would only have like one jean, but I am not there yet. We just <sighs> my mom's gonna kill me. I never wear it. I it's not comfortable. Who am I kidding? I bought this in Paris and this is freaking sexy. I'm not throwing this out for nothing. <laughs> I my butt looks good in that. I'm gonna <coughs> if I'm being honest, my butt shows, but it shows my nipples. Can't I just keep all of them? The whole point of this is to eliminate my options. And I just want to give myself all of the options. These two, I can't, I can't. But it's so soft and it's, it's like I haven't worn it in the past here. But like, but like. This is so hard. This jacket is so stylish. Is it my style though? No, it is not. It has got to go. I'm so sorry. <coughs> <coughs> Do I have the coronavirus? I've been sneezing the whole day. <gasps> this one has got to go. <coughs> Don't look back. Don't look back. And I can't throw one out. Am I gonna wear this? No, probably not. But it's so cute. Ah. <coughs> Cute. The whole point of minimalism is to minimize my options. It looks so cute. This is so pr Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, we're getting rid of it. I don't even think it would be this hard to decide between PJs. I can't choose. I can't be that hard. This is getting annoying. I'm annoying myself. Aww. I know, right? Like, that's so pretty. I 
literally done everything. It's now time for my shoes. You won't believe how much clothes I'm throwing out. Um, what's this? Oh, this is where my fancy went. I have these, which I'm never going to wear. Brand new. Never wore them before. Am I? Am I? Am I going to wear it? Oh my gosh, I'm going to throw out Birkenstocks. Guys. Okay, so I've got one, two, three pairs. I'm so impressed with myself. These, yeah, I don't wear them. Oh, I'm throwing it out. I threw it out. I did it. Okay, wait. That's annoying. Okay, so I'm basically done. I went through all of my clothes. I have so much extra hangers right now. The final part for this step four is to just, you know that baby, baby, not baby, 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 me, ah! I have so much space in my closet, guys. I'm just gonna keep it like... Are you guys ready to see the pile of clothes that I'm getting rid of? Oh my gosh, that is literally half of my closet, guys. Look how empty my closet is. Like, let's get all of this clothes into black bag. Sorry for the bad lighting right now. Not a lot. I expected more, not gonna lie. Time for the final step, step number five, which is to organize. So I will be doing this step off camera mainly because it's getting dark. And then tomorrow I will show you the final product. And yeah, so time, what is it called? Time travel to tomorrow. Okay guys, it's the next day and my room is a mess, so just ignore that. <laughs> I finished with my closet and I'm not gonna lie, I'm really impressed with myself. I've got two full black bags. Step five was to organize and um, double check everything. And basically what I did is I literally went through every single item in my closet and I fit it on. It really helped me to get rid of a few more items, which... What I also did is I went through my feed on Instagram and on TikTok and I looked at my outfits and everything and that caused me to go get a few stuff out of the black bags because I realized, damn, like I don't want to throw that away. So this is the final result. I counted everything. I have just over 50 stuff hanging in my closet. My end goal is to size that down to 25 items. So what I'm going to do to reach my end goal is, as you can see, all of my hangers are turned the wrong way around and I will be giving myself six months to turn those hangers around. Also, I used to color code my closet. If you look at the old footage, it looks really pretty and I really want to do that again. But what I decided to do for now is organize it by category. So all of my shirts are together, all of my dresses, etc. And that just helps me to see how many shirts I have and how many dresses I have. And then when I reach my end goal of only 25 pieces, I will color code it again. For my shoes, I downsized to 10 pairs. I don't know how many pairs I had. But now I only have 10. So subscribe if you're not subscribed. So that you won't miss out on all of my videos. Hit the notification bell. So that you will be notified. But yeah. I'll see you guys in the next video. Which will be the one that I'm filming today. Organizing my room.